Hello guys and welcome back, today we will make this animation. Start off by adding a meta ball and move it to the side. This will be our droplet and we will add a glass material to it with a little roughness. Now go into the meta ball uh, property tab and set the resolution of the viewport and the render to something lower so we have a higher quality ball. Now I will add in a subdivision surface modifier to a plane, this will be our emitter and I'll move it to the side. I'll go into the particles and add a new particle system. I will set the number to 10,000, the end frame to 20 and the lifetime to 200. They are falling to the ground, so I'll set the gravity to zero. Now they are moving to the side, but very slowly. So I'll add in a wind force to control that. And I'll set the strength to around six. They are going through the can, so set the can as a collision object. Now add in a turbulence force field and move it in between our wind and our cane and set the strength to around 4. This will ensure some randomness and it will also add a force that will spread our droplets apart. Now move them a little closer so they are colliding with the cane. And go into render and change to object and choose your droplet, your meta ball. Set the scale randomness to 1 and the scale to 0.1. Now place your camera, camera as you like, set the depth of field to the can and uh, adjust as you like for more realism. I'll adjust the camera again, set a backdrop at a pastel color, add lighting, it's just a tri light. And I'll add a ball around it to make the droplets look more like water and not have this dark edge because of the environment. That's it, you're done. Thank you for watching, I'll see you again soon.